Hi guys, it's your girl Belinda up in my kitchen getting ready to chef up some deliciousness. So please don't miss it. All these clips are going to be together. So it's Friday. Friday. Yay. Yay. Friday. <laughs> okay. So um, what we're doing today, I'm doing a little bit of small chicken thighs for my kiddos because um, my little yum yum, he does not eat fish. So I'm doing a great tasting salmon fish. You don't want to miss all the ingredients I got up in this bad boy. And I'm doing a wonderful fancy green mixed uh, salad as well. And I'm going to break down all this simple ingredients to you very quickly. Uh, I have everything prepped up on my station for you guys to check out. And um, we are going to go from there. So my oven's uh, preheating right now so I can stick the chicken wings in or the chicken thighs. The little, I got little baby ones, the ones that are really small. They already came clean, cut up nice and clean. Um, and they've been marinating over here. Um, so I'm going to do a little flip side here so we can see everything I got. And um, it's Friday, Friday, yay. <laughs> so let's do this. Okay guys, so what we got going, over, going on over here, it's been a long morning. I had a lot of appointments for myself this morning. Okay, so I'm going to show you my board here. All right, let's do a little flip side. Now wait. Okay, so I'm happy Friday. Like I said, I am doing a salmon. Okay, a little fish I threw there. So I'm doing a salmon, as I mentioned earlier, a fancy mixed green salad. It's already ready. It's in a bag over here. I'm about to show you guys in a second. And little baby thighs in the oven for the kiddos. So that's what I have going today. Going on today, I have my ingredients written down here. Okay. So let's get to my station. All right. So here are my chicken uh, baby thighs right here. Now, however, um, I the only ingredient I put into this is a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, and some sofrito. That is it for the chicken. Very simple. Keep it simple, guys, in your kitchen. When you keep things simple, things cook faster. And, um, you know, especially days like this on Friday. And they still come out super delicious, especially when you use sofrito. Sofrito is my number one uh, ingredient in my kitchen that I use a lot, along with my other um, uh, sazon and all-purpose adobo and all those other great goya ingredients. Okay, so here's my beautiful salmon. It's still packed up. I still need to wash this, okay? Like I said, I'm just actually prepping up right now. Um, and uh, so let's get right to it simple ingredients that I'm using on my salmon. I'm doing an Old Bay, okay, seasoning. I am doing uh, oregano, and I am doing some honey. That is all I'm using for my salmon. However, I'm also doing the pasta. So I'm basically gonna sit the salmon fish on top of uh, uh, the pasta, is how I'm gonna do it. I'm using mozzarella garganto and one packet of salsong into this loveliness for color okay all right so that is the simple ingredients that I'm putting into um, the fish and into uh, onto my lovely pasta okay my elbow macaroni all right so the the great ingredients I want to share with you is on the basically in the salad okay so if you see here I have this fancy green Fresh Express Crunchy crunchy Blend. It has uh, excellent source of vitamin K, as you know, all the good stuff. It has uh, Romanian lettuce, it has green tango, it has rochita, and carrots. These are the all the blend mixed, and I thought it's a beautiful blend, a lot of good stuff in there, so that's what I'm using. I am using pumpkin seeds, y'all. You have to try these pumpkin seeds. You can eat them as is, you can roast them, you can throw toss them into a salad. And guess what, guys? Pumpkin seeds are very good for your bones. Um, so please Google that. Check that out. They're very good for your bones. Um, it's better than milk. Um, so you might want to try that. Okay? This is a great source of vitamin D. Okay? And it has other stuff in it as well. Love pumpkin seeds. Okay? So this is the best way to go, especially if you're like lactose intolerant or you have those kind of issues this is very good and very great for your bones like i said all right so that's one of my ingredients that's going into my fancy green blend 
and I'm gonna be toasting them. I'm not gonna put them as is. I'm gonna be toasting them very lightly with some olive oil. Um, my dressing I'm using is the Honey Dijon from Ken's. I'm doing red pepper into the salad as well. A little bit of pe black pepper uh, corn uh, from the grinder there. I'm doing Haste Avocado and some lemon. So guys, you don't wanna miss this dish. Simple ingredients in your kitchen. So much great flavor. Okay, so you don't wanna miss it. All right guys, so stay tuned for the deliciousness. Here we go. Okay guys, so for Mother's Day, I'm doing something very simple. I always put balloons up in the sky for my mama. I never miss that. Every year for Mother's Day, me and my kiddos, we go and we put balloons in the sky. For my mom, we find different places to go do them. Last, last time we did them, I believe was behind the house. The time before that, we did them at Blue Marsh. So I'm thinking about doing Blue Marsh again, but I don't know if Blue Marsh is open right now for, for us to just go through the lake here in Reading. Um, you know, I'm pretty sure it might be, but if not, we'll find another spot. Okay, so that's what me and my kiddos are doing. Me and my daughter are going to have a lovely dinner together here at home. Um, we are seafood heads, so we're doing a seafood thing together, me and my daughter. And um, my yum yum, he'll be good with his sweets. Trust me on that. <laughs> um, okay, and so yes, I also wanted to share that. I'm keeping it very simple to post some rain. It's not, not going to be really good weather on Sunday, so... You know, so I'm just keeping it home and just enjoying it with my kiddos. They're the number one thing in my life. Okay, so um, also I wanted to mention, um, I also wanted to mention, yes, so I will be cooking on Sunday. So please don't miss that, okay? All right, so let's get the prep in and let's prep with love and let's cook with love today and let's enjoy this lovely Friday. Yay. Okay, guys, today is... Thursday. Just got done doing a great workout. Super tired. <laughs> Keeping my workout up. However, lots and lots of things I've been doing at home. So just trying to keep up with myself in the middle of everything. So uh, the next thing I'll be cooking will be tomorrow. It's going to be some salmon. Can't wait to share that dish with you. So please don't miss it. Tomorrow, Friday, salmon with some delicious ingredients you don't want to mess your girl hello guys it is friday please don't mind this hair <laughs> um friday yay so today i'm going to be doing that beautiful salmon so please check me out a little bit later all these clips are going to be together very beautifully as always um so it's going to be a little on the rainy side on the east side uh, for mother's day for pretty much all weekend However, I plan on making the best of it with my kiddos, doing something special with my kids, and um, just go from there and enjoy my mommy's day. A mother's work is never done, remember that. So I just put my hair up in a clip, just did my workout, super exhausted. Um, so I have lots of appointments this morning that I need to handle, so you won't see me cooking until a little bit later today. Um, can't wait to uh, spend time with my very special friend, Jessica. Um, see you later, babes. <laughs> Gonna be enjoying this meal with my Jesse. So, however, um, I'm just trying to hang in there, guys. A lot's been going on um, around me and trying to deal with things little by little. That's one day at a time, one step at a time. Um, so, obviously, I have a doctor's appointment this morning, so I got a quick hurry up and get going. My kiddos are going to be online doing their thing, and um, I'm just grateful for a lot of things. So it was good to be grateful for even the small things. So, however, I cannot wait to share this dish with you later. Something so, so delicious. So, um, back to that. So, um, me and my brother still have not gotten a chance to, to map things out. I mean, we map things out. We have everything set up, you know, up in here. What we have planned, something simple, but something really nice, neat, and pretty to do my bedding. But we've been getting some crazy weather and the days that we've been having good weather, I've been stuck, you know, doing other things with my kiddos, appointments, etc. So um, hopefully we're gonna be get, getting together after the Mother's Day weekend. Hopefully uh, uh, by next weekend we can start doing, working on things. 
So however, I just wanted to say hello and catch me later today. And it's your girl and I miss you like always. All right, ciao.